Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Surviving Mars. We're going to make a nice little circuit here. So that our power generation, for some reason, is failing on the regular, and I don't understand exactly why. If we make it stretch out here and then go down, that'll power this when we need it. So... So, and then down this way. And then down up this way. Sure, why not? Make a giant hex, like so. All right. Hey, look, we got people. One land, people. I'm sure it's totally safe and not dangerous at all to be stuck in a dome that has no power. But they can't actually live there yet. The apartment isn't built. They can only live in, the, in this place over here. They can work over here, but they can't live here. New colonists have arrived. And two colonists, colonists are leaving. That's okay. Departing. Still not two. Not too bad. Meteor storm worries me a little bit, but uh, not too much. We'll be okay. We we'll probably just need to stop building for a little while so that we can build up some resources. We only have six polymers right now. Yeah, we have more colonists coming in. This guy will be ready to go pretty soon, though. He just needs to refuel. The drones are taking care of that. So I think we have like 30 odd colonists in here. That'll be just fine for a little while. And that'll also boost up the non specialist working here. That could be dangerous. Okay. You're almost ready to go. As soon as you're ready to go, we can launch you and you'll pass the other guy. We pass Genity on her way out. Go ahead and take off now. Thank you very much for being here. The building not Prop working. Failure reported. Oh, right, because you don't have any power? What? Sector scanned. How Anomaly though? Found. I have so much power going on right now. But not enough. 148 out of 4. Yeah, okay, hold on. Pause. Pause, pause, pause. It's the dome taking up all the power, isn't it? Yeah, they require 77 power, 25 power. Why 77 there? Probably the buildings. Okay. Yep, I just need more power generation. Just across the board. So we're gonna do this. That's why we why we set up the lines. I just wasn't keeping proper track. That's totally my bad. So each one of these does seven. We need how much? We need forty seven. So that's seven more, right? Because it'd be forty nine. So three, four, five, six, seven. You know what? I'm gonna do ten. Eight. Um, that would be nine right there if you weren't in the way. So why don't you go ahead and move over here? I don't know. Actually, move over here. Let's gather up your guys. I mean, it's just machine parts. We have some of those. Not plenty, but some. And they'll start building these guys up. And then that'll help with their power generation more. Uh, you know what? On this side, on the other side, we'll make power solar panels. Rotate so I see this better. Okay, so. Along this side, just solar panels, please. That should help as well. Mostly during the day, but still. Help with the battery, anyway. And those we can build a little bit faster since that's just metal. Right, that'll help. Won't help tomorrow. Oh, the crop failure. Why do we have a crop failure? You guys are botanists. How did you make the... I hate you so much. Now, fortunately, we have plenty of food. You guys are botanists. You did make the food work. Okay. The university will work eventually once we get it built. Okay, now the meteor storm is going. Where's it at? I don't even see it. Oh, it's way over there. Oh, we're so good then. Okay. And we have more colonists coming in. I'm sure it's totally safe. Not dangerous at all with all the power failures we're having, but hey, we're, produ we're producing by five for a little bit anyway. And most of those are wind turbines, so that'll happen even at night. In fact, it is nighttime. Yeah, all these guys are down, so we're good. We're good. New colonists have arrived. Hey guys, welcome to the party. Good to have you. Good to have you. Welcome to the party. Oh, you know what? I've named these domes. Should name these. We're going to speed three here as I ask our bot of the universe 
to go ahead and give me some random followers. So let's see, we got one there, one there, all right. So we have Sirachi Rogers and Dirty Trucker. That's just entertaining, all right, sure. I love the names, they're great. Sirachi Rogers. I can type, I can type. I'm actually gonna capitalize, no, 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 we don't capitalize, we're good. And this one here is Dirty Trucker. There you go. All right. And you're almost ready to go? You are, you have an export gathered right now. Oh, because we have this guy going. Holy smokes. I mean, as much as I appreciate that, as much as I would appreciate the extra cash, I'm going to say no. We're going to forbid the export. Get rid of that resource. Get, get back on the track here. Give me a depot for the rare metals. We're going to have a lot of it. I'm going to stick that right next to you. So the drones don't have to go very far. And now you're ready to go. Okay. That's actually great. That means the electronics can start going. It's it's a fantastic day. We're producing by 54. Only one for the water, but we'll get there. We'll get there. Probably means we need to do a Sector little bit more scanned. in terms of food production. I'm a little scared for our food production, so what can we do for this? We only unemployed. No, surprisingly, nobody's unemployed. The people. Always need more people. Well, this is going to take a while to build, right? Yeah, it requires some concrete. we got to slowly get that. We could make a second concrete producer, and it could, that ha could happen. There's a concrete guy up here, totally free and clear. Nobody's going to bother him. Don't do that. Um, there we go. And then build in the power. Straight line should be fine. Oh, okay, not quite straight, huh? about like this. There you go. That works. Okay, so that doubles our concrete production. Probably don't need that long term, but this is not a long term fix anyway. This is a small depot. Yeah, 282. Barely even worth a squeeze, really, but we'll do it anyway. Actually, that should help. And we'll build the university. Our non-specialists will totally get trained. It'll be great. In the meantime, we have some medics. They'll go over to service building, so that's fine. We gotta think about other things for their comfort, though. So, like a playground. Playground's good. Helps children get perks. It's almost as good as school, except that hopefully the kids have more fun. So let's go ahead and do that. Speaking of school, I don't actually don't want school. I don't want school. Because this does the same thing as the playground does. The playground just costs polymers. Now, granted, we're not rolling in polymers, but we could theoretically roll in polymers pretty soon. So, I would rather the kids go play in the playground than go to school. You know, school requires homework. I hated school growing up. If they had just told me, hey, go to the playground, I think that would have been great. Resources are low. Living space for children. Eh, uh, maybe, I don't know. The thing is, we have apartments already. Eh, uh, for eight children, I don't know if it's worth it. I don't know. Consumes two power. Resources are low. If it gave us more, I don't know, give us something more for that. I would definitely go for it, but I don't want to. Okay, so in case we do get alcoholic, space bar is not bad. Plus, it's also good for relaxation and drinking. It does require non specialists to work there. And see, anything that requires more jobs, I think we've got to be careful of, right? Because we don't have any jobs to spare right now, we don't have any people to spare. We don't even have the person Martian born yet, right? That's somewhere in, not Command Center, that'd be Resources in are low. Milestones. Yeah, we don't have first Martian born yet. So since we're not there yet, I'm not going to do it. Polymers and, oh yeah, machine parts are Research low, you're right. Complete. Cross sleep research is done, so we can get more people per shipment, which is great. We'll need it. Maybe as soon as this arrives, I need it to turn around. The machine parts, yeah, we're not generating nearly as many as we need. Right? 
Yeah, maintenance is 1.5, production is only 1. We need more people. I mean, that goes into, you know, training more people, which is what this is for. And that'll be good. And then we can totally spare... Yeah, so we have some non-specialists going into training right now. Sector scan. I'm going to let this go auto. I realize we do need engineers. You know what? I'm going to specify that specifically. Engineers. You guys are trained in STEM fields, you know? Congratulations. STEM fields are almost always needed. That'll be good for you. Really, I'm sure. Right, so then that means non-specialists get pulled away from achieved. the grocer. Okay, now we have Miles Martian board. Okay, so then we do just need more people. I mean, that's just what it comes down to. Vacant residential slots with 18 people available here, or slots available here. 23 here, yeah, so that's basically a shuttle. That's a one shuttle worth of people, and we have a shuttle that just landed on Earth. So, passenger rocket. <laughs> 32, yeah. So, I don't care what they are right now. I think as long as they fit the criteria, we should not have any of those flaws, and we're good to go. I don't care what they are, launch that bad boy. Because we need those people, for sure. Then, maybe we might have an employment problem, but who knows. So, give me a second. Uh, we can't do a second shift yet, huh? We gotta wait for those, those guys to come in. Then we'll see what we can do. Okay, we do 9.8 per soul. That's good. We do need the metal. Only 2 per soul for you, huh? That sucks. How are we doing on that, anyway? When you say no production at all, I don't believe you. I mean, I guess the last soul we didn't have any production for some reason. Why wouldn't we have any production for polymers? That doesn't make any damn sense. That is very strange. I don't know. I, I don't understand. We don't really... Yeah, we're okay there, I think. Yeah, you're going so slow. You're going to take a long time to go through the store of red metals. I think that's okay. I mean, you're a non-specialist, too, so we definitely need the engineers. Alright, well, that's what the, what the training's for, right? The Martian-born, of course, are going to be born with no training whatsoever. Naturally. You don't come out of the womb knowing what you're going to do. Would that be nice or would that be horrible? I don't know. Every time you hear about these caste systems where you're born into something and knowing exactly what you're going to be doing the, your whole life, there's something comforting about that, but also something really, really scary. I don't know. Two months of that. Oh, uh, we need... We need moisture evaporators for sure. Yeah. We're at zero right now. That cannot be good for us. We're not stocking anything. Well, okay, we are. We're stocking 0.4. Actually, we're not stocking at all anymore. Stored water is full up. Um, give me another water tower. I think we can build one right there and be fine. Seems just sad to let the 0.4 just stock up there with no recourse. Costs a little bit of metal, but I think that's okay. We are building the metal anyway. Look at that. That built so fast. So we'll just stock that up. Might as well. It's a little bit. Okay, now that improved our... That's weird. Oh, you know what? Nighttime, we'll probably have less of a... Right, we have less of a draw. And you're barely building anything anyway. Only... Okay, you know Sector what? Sector scanned. Anomaly found. I'm tempted. Tempted. Turn this on. Four per soul is still more than we need. We don't have shuttles. If we had shuttles, I'd be worried about our fuel production, but we don't, so not. Passage would be nice, but it costs way too much that we don't have. We have to wait. Just sit here and wait and look at this, and that's all we can do. It's just sit here and wait and look. Because we have passing we have colonists incoming. But they're gonna be a while. We have the ability to be self-sufficient, but we don't quite have the capacity for it. So, it's going to be a while. We just sit here, wait, let things scan, let things go. Um, we can definitely bring in more stuff if we need it. I mean, that's what the next shuttle does. It brings in 
more polymers and more machine parts, because that's really what we seem to need. So let's go ahead and, yeah, let's call it another shuttle. Cargo rocket. I need, let's say, 35. And machine parts, right? Yeah, because we have a ton of electronics right now. Do we need anything else? Um, sure, give me some more moisture evaporators if you can. don't have the ability to make these myself yet. Um, we don't need another one of those yet. We will when we make another city, but we don't we don't have the ability yet. Um, and fill in the extra spot with, I don't know, an extra drone or two. Yeah, there you go. And there you go. Genity can launch with that. That'll help. There are Earthsick colonists. Yeah, that's not too surprising. So let's see what they're why they're sick. You are sick because no available service building for shopping. That'll help when we get the colonists in. Right? We're getting like 32 colonists in. Um, some of those guys will undoubtedly be non-specialists and they will work at the grocery store or whatever. But well rested, that's good. We should do, I think, is building some comfort. Anything to make them feel a little bit better about being in the world. So let's make a garden. It does fill in a lot of space here, but maybe like a little bit of extra space just for comfort is not necessarily a bad idea. Especially the apartment is not comfortable, this kind of cramped space. So maybe they'll feel better. A wet fountain, a lake. Various other things. Statue's good too. Let's say it's a statue of a founder. Why not? They're right in the central square there. And maybe, let's see, a stone garden? Too big. There's some more small gardens here. There you go. Cost is a little bit of concrete, but I think totally worth it. And actually, our concrete's starting to look in a decent spot now. And that comfort will help everybody in this dome. We can do the same thing here. We basically surround the playground with a bunch of gardens and maybe a stone garden there. There you go. That'll help. The stones are, of course, made of concrete, but, you know, you don't necessarily know that when you're looking at it. We go to Disneyland. You know, it's that kind of stone garden where everything is obviously planned. Nothing is real there, but it's nice. It's comfortable. It's friendly. It's... It's pretty. You know, that's the type of stuff we're looking at here. And if there's a launch pad there, maybe we should put a, put a passage ramp here. Maybe one here too. What the hell? Make sure if you need to carry food like down to this stone, they don't need to go all the way. Well, they'd have to go through. They'd have to go all the way around and then through. No reason to do that. We can just build a passage right now. Okay. We can zoom in a lot, one or two. Um, and then Sector take a look scan. at our dome, like so. A little puzzle of what you guys are doing there. All right. I mean, that's barely, that's barely exercise, guys. Come on. I mean, the squats are good. But the back and forth like that, come Research on. Complete. Okay, good. We can make our own machine sector now, or our, mach our machine areas now. Automated storage is nice, I like that. Dome bioscaping. Residences, basic domes, microdomes, and barrel domes have improved comfort. And we're in basic domes now. You know what? Extra comfort means more Martian-born? I'm okay with that. That's actually good. Uh, we did all the breakthroughs. I suppose they're not doing anything in robotics right now. Should be. So, sure, automated storage. That's nice. And I mean, that makes us 40. Let's do medium domes. That's actually could be pretty good for our next city. Probably want to do the moxie and the improved storage, too, but we'll hold off on that for now. And the exercises seem pretty silly here. I mean, the squats are good. The pull-ups are good. But come on, the back and forth like that, that's not going to get you anything. Not any benefit at all. Do you have doctors here? You do have doctors. They should be telling you these things. You know, actually, a second shift for doctors might not be too bad. Might be good. We almost have colonists in here. 32. It's going to be quite the load. 
We know we can handle it. Yeah, one resident's all by herself here. In fact, I think it's a kid. Beta Comet. Yeah, usually when they have names like that. Yeah, child. The youngest resident's the colony. Yeah, that's probably our Martian born. It's probably Beta Comet. It's a great name, by the way. Beta Comet. Wouldn't name of anyone like that on Earth, but, you know, Mars is a different planet. Alright. Hey, guys. Welcome. Hope you brought your food with you. Oh, you know what? We totally need another farm, don't we? Let's do that right now. Let's farm. Colonists are departing. One colonist leaving. That's not so bad. As soon as you're ready to go, let me know. This farm should be built pretty easily, I think. And then once that's done... I mean, that should be enough, right? 67 people. 86 food right now. And right now our food consumption is 7, but... It's not going to hold up for long. Oh, you don't need grocery stores here, don't we? Shoot, we do. Because they're not going to go here for the grocery store, I don't think. There are earth sick colonists. Why are you guys earth-sick? You guys want a bar or something? I mean, we could probably make that happen, but... Why? Uh, do we need the grocery store? It seems like they'd be able to use a service building over there. I don't know. Okay, you ready to go? Thank you, Angel Frozen Beats. You've been very helpful. And we're not taking anything with you, right? You're for we're forbidding exports. No, waiting for resource and mud. Okay. Yeah, you have to specify that per rocket. Otherwise, they'll take stuff. As soon as you're done with that. Oh, you still got the food to unload, too. Um, we could probably use another food depot. What are we going to build here? Wheat's not so bad. Let's do wheat and... Oh, we do have the cover crops. That'll increase our soil quality. Cover crops there and then potatoes. Yeah, that'll help. Over here, let's do cover crops here. Not a great yield, but it will help. Or with our soil quality, which I'll you later. Ready to go? Ready to go, right? E yes, you're ready to go. Alright, take off. Okay, food looks like it's ready to go. Potatoes would be great for us. I love potatoes. Sector scanned. Sector scanned. Oh, idle extractor. You were done, huh? Alright, trash you. Not quite enough. Not quite enough concrete for this, so I guess we'll build another one. Uh, let's see. This way, I guess? As soon as it's deconstructed, yeah, we should be able to build it... Like, here, here. It's not a great place for us. How about, like... Build it inside. Um, I guess here would be okay. There. I mean, give me power here. There you go. All right, negative one on water right now, probably because our fuel refiner is going. So we definitely need more moisture evaporators. Well, that's why our supplies are coming in. Yeah, six moisture evaporators would be great. We can fill in all this area. It'll be fantastic. So to that end, might as well have some pipes all set up. So that we can take advantage of putting the mushroom evaporators wherever we want them. Uh, we might as well put this here for the metal extractor. So that people can actually work here if they want it. Ready to land, huh? Alright. Uh, I'm going to put you over here because that's where most of our drones are. Right, and food production. Food production is going to require storage. Colonists are departing. Can I do this yet? I can't do this yet. Okay. Food depot right there for now. Okay, so that gives us six moisture evaporators. As soon as you guys are building all these, we'll make that happen. The colonists are leaving, huh? You know what? Good riddance. Good freaking riddance. You guys probably want a space bar or something silly like that. Well, tough shit. You don't get a space bar. Well, maybe. Do you? No, I think tough shit. You don't get a space bar. No space bar for you. 
Security station is not a bad idea. Grocer, you know what? I don't like walking seven blocks to the grocery store if I don't have to. So I'm okay with making a grocer here. I'll make another grocer right here. We can't build the three, the full triangle worth anyway because the passages are there. So grocer there would be okay. It does need to be stocked with people, but hopefully we have non-specialists. Let's actually look to see how our colonies are doing in terms of people. We have one person unemployed. You know what? You're seeking work. That's good for you. Um, actually can't tell. Oh, here we go. No specialization. We have 26. That should be enough. That should totally be enough to get the grocery stores and whatever else needed. And if they can't find work, that's what the university is for. Hey, man, it's free education. Just sitting there waiting for you to use. All right, we have tons of people in the electronics factory, so that's great. Good set of people in the rare metals extractor. I could make a second work shift. Tempting? Maybe not necessary, though. You guys are all set to go. You guys are good there. Okay, then in that case, set you to auto. I don't know what you guys need. I guess we still need engineers. Sector scanned. But for what? Oh, I guess, yeah, these non-specialists could be replaced by engineers. Um, yeah. You know, I could do a second shift there, but I think we'd be better served... If we just had a second research, right? Second research lab would totally be good enough. So, there you go. Second research lab. Stock that with scientists, whoever else we need. Okay. Now we just wait for things to build up. We're slowly getting polymers we need. We have tons of electronics because we ship a lot to us. We're building more anyway. Building more machine parts. Only 2.3 per soul, though. Well, could start a second shift. Though only one person's unemployed. How, how are we doing on people? On rather, no, on uh, residences, I should say. So, no free residences here. Two free residences here. Ten free residences. Okay, so we can get 12 people. Their current setup. I can build another apartment complex that could fit another 30 Assuming we have the jobs. We could get the jobs. Well, one person unemployed here. That, that's easily fixed, right? And we just start the polymer production a little bit faster, maybe? Yeah, you know what? Let's do a second shift for polymer. What the hell? That, yeah, so they prefer to work there. That's okay. That works. I guess a little bit more per soul there. Do I have an unemployed over here? No. Okay. Yeah, that works out. A lot of disabled work slots over here, but I'm okay with that. We're getting some scientists, we get some farmers. Wow, a lot of botanists. That's a lot of botanists. Okay. Do you guys just not like hydroponic farming? Apparently not, because a scientist is working there. Uh, shouldn't you be doing research? What the hell are you doing there? Alright. Well, I mean, I can't be too mad at you. At least you're working. As long as you don't make a failed crop, I'm fine with that. Research complete. Batch amplification done. Okay, so this is great. So that uses more power, right? Yeah, production by 25% by more power by 20. Wow. So we're not quite there yet. We could be. You're not shipping anything out. That's great. So go ahead and take off. Okay, so research 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 we are not researching anything in physics right now so i guess dust repulsion i guess it's only for solar panels though the sterling generators are okay if you put them inside a dome they actually don't require much maintenance at all i think instead we're going to go for more applicants because that's pretty useful and it's pretty far back in the tree Optimization, I don't care about. I mean, filtering could be good. Oh, what well, we could do. Yeah, we have the polymers for it. I totally forgot. We can totally make hydrostropic coating now. Of course, two polymers per, but I think it's totally going to be worth it. Going to make more power, more uh, water available. And that'll just generally help us. So we definitely want to do that for all these. I need to turn around here so I can see these properly. So we're going to upgrade all of these. 
That means we don't need the moisture evaporators built just yet. We will, but we don't need it yet. We at least have the loop, which is good. That'll help us in case of a meteor strike in a bad place or a dust devil in a bad place. How's the scanning going? Seven, eight, nine. Get in there. We have a lot of research down here we need. Okay, so we need to start thinking about how we're going to do our next city. And we're not full up on the city yet. We're getting there, but we're not there yet. Building isn't working. Sector oh. scanned. Why are you not... Are you waiting for the fuel? I didn't realize you needed fuel. Okay, with the water and the place it is, we can definitely boost this up. It's a little dangerous right now, but as soon as these guys get... Yeah, as soon as they get their water production up, we'll be in a good spot that this can work 24-7. 25-7, sorry. And that'll be fine. Concrete's doing okay. Concrete, they're doing okay. Yeah, so as soon as we get you your your water that you need, or your sorry, your fuel that you need. And after worship right now. Okay, so we'll get you your your fuel pretty soon. You're gonna be working full tilt. Water's gonna be going full tilt, and we're gonna be overproducing, in fact. Which is great. We do need more stored water, but I kinda wanna wait for water tanks. So we'll build a water tank like right in here. I think that'll be good. Otherwise it's just a bunch of empty space. Which is fine, but not that great. Okay, so you guys are building, you guys are making this happen. We are down 200 here. As soon as, I think we're gonna just keep one going at a time. I don't think we need two. We already have a second one over here. And then when this guy runs out, we'll move him over here. So we do need metal production everywhere. Okay, so I think another apartment, right? And maybe another farm. That'll probably do it. Do we need anything else? We probably need like luxury. Yeah, like art store gives you luxury. We don't really have a lot of luxury. I guess the space bar. It gives you drinking. The casinos also gives you like a lot of luxury, gaming, gambling, social. We don't have another out for gaming. Okay. Okay. I can't. Yeah. I mean, we can't stop people from coming here if they like gaming. So we're going to do that. That does require a non-specialist. I guess we might have the ability to do that. Uh, we are going to need people, though. So we need an apartment complex. Give me an apartment complex. If we do an arcology. That would be great for the spires here. What spires do we have right now? I think just the water production, right? Yeah, water reclamation. That's it. Um, that's a nice, okay spire. It does require workers. I'm not wild about it, though. It'd be good if I put all my farms in the same dome. I did not do that this time, and that was probably a mistake. Too late now, though. I could probably shuffle some stuff around, but it would be expensive as all fuck. So I don't want to do it. Can't make me. Can't make me. Won't do it. So with the apartment complex done, we could probably even knock down one of these luxury apartments and build apartments instead. Yeah, knock down this, make apartments. We can't afford the room right now. If we do that now, a lot of people are going to be homeless. I do not want that to happen. I could build in some comfort here. Or I could build in the... Sector scanned. Anomaly build in the art found. store. Requires polymers, but we are making polymers. Sure. Keep the luxury shopping. This isn't luxury, is it? No, this is luxury. Okay, no, if they want luxury, that's good. They want shopping, they can go here. Okay, so I'm not going to worry about luxury shopping. Then. And that does gaming, which I don't care about right now. We already have the diner. Space bar. That's a little tempting. So... Did spacebar? We need the room for it. We don't really have room for a spacebar right now. I could trade out one of the farms for hydroponics, and then put it in a spacebar, but that seems stupid. I don't want to do that. We need the food, man. These people need to eat. 
That's more important than drinking at a space bar, right? Right. Right. I hope you realize that's right. I hope you realize the answer is yes. Oh, man. I hope so. I hope that's true. 7.5, that's pretty good. So we can up production if we want power to... Oh, shoot, man. We don't have power to spare, do we? We kind of do and we kind of don't, right? We do have those mysterious power outages that happen periodically. Until we get fusion generators, I think we just leave this be for now. I do want it. I would like it. I don't think we can justify it, though. So we're not going to do it. I want to so much, but the power requirements are just too high. You guys are all 1.5 now, right? Yeah, the only reason why you're not producing more is probably because we don't have the uh, we don't have the storage for you. So that's okay. We'll uh, we'll get there. We're not there yet. A bunch of prefabs for water recommenders. That means we don't build them here. Maybe we build them elsewhere. So shuttles are really the next big thing we want. We just don't know where they are. And we won't for a while. The only way we're going to know where shuttles are if we start doing more research exploration stuff down in the valley. Or in the plateau. In the upper plateau. So how do we do this? So the drone commander can get over here, and that'll help. But really what we need is drone hubs, a series of them, making a line to wherever we want the passage to be. Research complete. And it looks like most of the research is going to be down here. Look at this. A bunch of research right there I really want. Yeah, a bunch of it all over the place in this valley. The plateau, we just it's too mysterious. We don't know any of this right now. I would love it, but I don't know that I would love it. I just love the idea, but I don't actually know what I want. Alright, will you? Lowers the risk of colonists developing flaws after sanity breakdown. I, mean, I hope they never have a sanity breakdown, but I understand that is important. Um, I think shuttles are either in the robotics or the physics tree, so let's say it's physics. It might be engineering, too. So we'll, do, we'll say it's physics, we'll go with dust repulsion. Once dome bioscaping is done, we'll go to storage compression and work our way through. Actually, just by researching this, that should open up something over here too, right? Theoretically. Okay, so what do we need for a tunnel? Assuming we build a tunnel, and I think that's going to be pretty much guaranteed, what do we need for it? Hold on, what did that say? I clicked on it instead. Okay, 30 machine parts. That's painful, painful but doable. 20 metal, that's no big deal. 80 concrete, that hurts a bit, Sector but scan. you do need to shore up Anomaly the tunnel, that kind of makes sense. Pipe leak reported. Okay. Troublesome, Cable fault reported. but not impossible. All right. So, where are we going to build this at? We can get rid of this on the side here. Okay, so we're going to build it. Our colonists are suffocating. What? We only have a few hours to... How, though? Oh, because the Dust Devil. The Dust Devil came through and wrecked me. This all needs to get repaired, guys. Now, fortunately, they're not actually suffocating. We do have plenty of stored oxygen. But that could have been better. In fact, I could use more of that stored oxygen. Let's actually put one over here. It's not going to help us now. It will help us in the long term, though. Give me another stored oxygen thing over here. Um, because that was really bad. That could have been much, much worse, actually, but... Yeah, we only have the one moxie, I think. Or no, we have two moxies. Give me another one here, though. Just, you know, just in case. Having a secondary moxie or trinary or tertiary moxie would be good. Okay, good. Moxie production's up. You can build that over there. That'll be fine. Yeah, the dust devil just tore through here. Wow. Fortunately, that wasn't so bad, but that could have been a lot worse. Okay, idle extractor. Oh, you're done, huh? All right. I think we build one more here, and that'll pretty much exhaust this uh, reported. this deposit. Crop failure? How, though? What did you do? 
Oh, because you're a scientist, not a botanist. Damn it, Jim. All right, no, that's fair. I mean, you're only a hydroponic farm. I wasn't really expecting much out of you anyway, but I am kind of upset. I'm a little upset. Hopefully people are being trained. Yeah, it's on auto right now, okay. Hopefully people are being trained to be botanists. All right, one more extractor in this general vicinity. I think we gotta destroy, destroy this here. Destroy that there, there you go. And then one more concrete extractor right about here, I guess? It's in a weird spot, but yeah, that should grab a good chunk. And then make the power go out this way. Okay, that'll help. You're still going, which I appreciate. We are going to need to build down this way for this big deposit anyway, right? Yeah, because this guy's like a thousand concrete. We need this anyway. So, build me out some drones. It's gonna be expensive as fuck, but we just gotta get used to that. Alright, so here we go. Um, you're gonna need Universal Depot, like, pretty close to you. So let's make that happen, too. Universal Depot right here, and I want that set to... Uh, three, it should be fine. No rare metals, no food. Concrete's okay, metal's okay. We need the electronics to build, we need the polymers. We need the machine parts, we do not need the fuel. There is an infirmary last worship, but there's an infirmary up here. What I would love, though, is a spire that gives us medicine for, I think that's, I mean, it's research we don't have yet. These guys don't require power, right? Sector I think Throne Hub doesn't require power, it just requires a lot of, a lot of electronics. So we'll build there. That's going to be a long... We need like three hubs to get down to this. And another hub to get to the passageway. It's going to be... It's going to be tricky. What are you doing? Probably a secondary shift here might up our production. We're only making one per soul. That's just not enough. Over your load. Second work shift here is not a bad idea either. We already have a secondary work shift. Machine parts are working on one workshop. Only one guy? Excuse me? All the engineers went for other work. Oh, they all went to the Palmer factory? Are you actually shitting me? Okay, well, one trick I did learn last time. One trick I did learn last time is I put this for its heavy load. They will ditch here. So I'm going to say this is your heavy load. They can go to the infirmary to increase their, their to improve their sanity or regain it rather. So once they realize this is heavy load, they'll go, oh shit, I don't want to work here anymore. And they'll go to the machine part factory instead. Now granted we do need the polymers, but come on, guys. Come on. Because it's theoretically easier work at both here and the machine part factory. We do need more people though. So we have the apartment complex, right? So now we can afford to bring in more people, so let's do it. Passenger rocket, please. Yeah, Bell is 33, rocket capacity 32. Matching column is 29, though, so we need to be a little bit less strict. Huh. Um, I really don't want the middle age, though, because then they age out of the workforce, and it's just seniors who don't do any work. So I really don't want that. So... I think we have to start setting people with less with more flaws. I really don't want the alcoholics. We don't have a space bar, so they're not going to be able to drink. We definitely don't want the idiots, because they just make things break all the time. Glutton might be okay. I'll, I think we can take gluttons. And there we go. That's it. Okay, gambler. We have a casino. But 50% chance to lose 20 sanity when visiting a casino. That sounds awful. Our performance lowered by 10. That's not so bad. I mean, the drinking means that he needs that. Yeah, no, I don't want it. I don't want it. I think this should be okay. Yeah, launch that. Give me 32 colonists. What the hell? It means the Martian-born are going to get crowded out, which means we need to build another city pretty soon. 
That's what we're on our way to doing now. Final deposits again. Oh, hello. Now that right. the most critical phase of the mission is behind us. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. I don't think we're going to be able to do it. We've been researching like crazy, but I don't think we can... We might be able to do it with outsourcing. But outsourcing right now just seems like a waste of cash. I don't know if it's worth it. We also don't need u pins. Uh, do we? Maybe we do. Okay, so they're filling up the depot, which is great. Now we'll make another drone hub down like here. Which should still be able to get to the depot, right? 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 Yes, just barely. Just barely. More importantly, get down to this concrete depot, which is great. Which means I don't think we need you anymore. Yeah, we don't need you at all. So scrap this. We need the power out there. We don't need any of that. Get rid of it. Because otherwise it's just maintenance we don't really need to pay. Alright, so you'll build this guy, which is great. This will fill in here. And then what? That's a good question. I think we want to build the passage like complete. over here. A dome bioscaping. That's good. That means everyone gets basically increased comfort. Which is great. Um, since dome bioscaping is done, graduate faster in universities and sanatoriums, have a higher chance to gain perks from schools. That's pretty damn good. That is pretty damn good. Though the Moxie upgrade, I think this costs polymers, but otherwise, I really don't need it. No, I think we do this instead. It's 3,000, but that's okay. Yeah, just let it tick. Just let it tick. Okay, then that lets us do this concrete. I think we'll build the passage like over here that'll get us down this way, and then maybe we just build a new colony down here to get the rare metal. Yeah, I was talking about that before, right? We throw the lineup of three domes right here. We'll get this metal, the rare metal. And then not to mention we'll be able to explore all around here and pick up all this stuff. That could be pretty good. Resources are low. How are we low on food? Oh, because we had a couple of crop failures, didn't we? Yeah. Because he sucks. Look at this. He's down to five. It's supposed to be ten. How are you down to half a yield already? Because we need a freaking... Yeah, he's just a regular scientist. He should be working in the research. You know what? I'll open up the research lab. Maybe he moves over there. And then, I don't know, getting a non-specialist in here would be a little bit better than just having a... I mean, he's almost a non-specialist at this point. Yeah, the food is in a bad way. Do I need another farm? Where would I even put it? Is the thing. I guess... I don't know what I would do. I guess I could scrap this, build in a permanent place... And then make another farm here. Yes. I have to hurry with that, though, because people are on the way. Yes, I have to hurry with that. Let's, uh... <laughs> because uh, those people are totally going to move over here. We got we to gotta do this fast. So scrap the building really quick. We got to build the apartment really quick. We got to do everything really, really fast. Before the people arrive and take up all the space that we don't actually have anymore. It's gonna, it's gonna be tricky. You can build this like as soon as that's destroyed. There you go. And then we build the farm, and yeah, then we'll be good. But it means no one's living in these luxury living quarters anymore. Sad to say. It's gonna be tricky, but that's okay. And that'll also happen next episode. So thank you guys for watching. This has been Surviving Mars on PC Universe Hero, PC Universe 2. I'll see you guys next time.